Okay, this is probably my worst video. This is going to be on my, my worst video that I've ever done. <sighs> How do I explain this? I adjusted the upper limit of the BMSs. That's all I did. Put it to, I think it was 3.45. Not not the highest you could do, not 3.5, nothing that what like, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Um, I left it overnight. Now I'd had no proper sun for that day. We've had a storm last night. We had bet 40 mils of rain. Um, not sure what that is in inches. You have to look that up if you're in America. I'm sorry about that. I know you guys use inches, but we use metric like the rest of the world. I'm sorry. Yeah, either get with us or, or don't bother. But, well, that's coming out. Anyway, all right. So that's turning on and off. I've got a dodgy BMS. I already, I already knew I had a dodgy BMS. I've got to replace it. I haven't had time. Um, I have had time, yeah. I have had time, but I've been doing other things. Okay, so. I have my trusty power supply set up for 48 point, 48 volts, 48.2, about 11 amps to go into the top battery. Now the bottom battery, it's miles out compared to the top battery. Now I'm going to have to test it to show it to you. Now this is my quick and dirty way of testing it. Now normally I'll have a clip. I don't have my clip at the moment. Oh, I have a clip and I'll clip that on there and just check the voltage. Now I'll just check it from here. Okay, I'm going to have to let you know. This one is sitting at 42.9 volts. Now, they are all connected up there. I have no idea. Now, I have no idea what's going on here. Um, why this isn't doing what it's meant to be doing. So the bottom one needs to go to 45 point whatever it is. Oh, I'll bring it down to 45.7 and we'll try and get this one, the bottom, my latest battery to come up to that uh, 45.7 and adjust it. Now, I don't know, this just happened the other night. Now I had no power on, that's another thing. I had barely anything going the other night and I have no idea why it was doing it. Uh, the only thing that was hooked up was my, um, let's put it this way, grey waste, um, grey waste water dumping system. We'll call it that. I don't want to call it what it is, not on YouTube. Um, so we'll try and uh, hook this up. I'll bring this down to 45. Uh, I'm just going to bring that down to 45.7. All right. So we'll hook this all up, quick and dirty way. Let's hook it to. This is my bottom battery. I'm sorry about my finger, and I'm sorry about using a phone again, fellas, to do a video, which pretty much doesn't pay me anything. You're getting money every <laughs> every every three or four months. I'm sorry. I'm just not a really great YouTuber. This is just hanging off there. That should be plugged into one of them. We'll get around to doing that later. I that's another thing. I bought these all set up. I think I showed you how to hook them up and that. They suggested using this. Now the orange pie does not, or the solar assistant does not communicate through two BMSs at once. I don't know why. You know, they're selling the stuff. Oh, no, it's not dear in the scheme of things, although it is dear enough. But I don't know why it's like that. Okay, now we've got them hooked up. Let's pop that on, see what happens. It's dropped down. So I'll leave that going for the next amount of time, try and organize it. But what it's coming up with an error for, 
So if you get an error four, check your batteries. Error four on a grow watt system. Um, look, I'm gonna say it. I'm starting to not like grow watt all that much. Uh, or is it the BMSs? What do you guys think? I've had a bit of trouble with the BMSs, a little bit of trouble with the grow watts, uh, but we're getting there. And there's all the switches off. The only switches that were on was the grey water dump. That was even off yesterday. Uh, anyway, all right, we'll see how we go. I've got to charge it from mains, yes, it's embarrassing, but it's what we've got to do. So in our final bit, I've brought the voltage back up to equivalent, or almost equivalent to the other battery. And now I'm getting just under a, a watt from each five, each side of the five kilowatts. So I've got five kilowatts either side of my system. Now this is still off. I'm gonna to have to change this one. It's getting 20 amps pushed into it, which is better than nothing. And that should keep going for a little while. Now I don't know why it turned off. Uh, anyone got any good guesses would be great. But you do get error four, like I said, in the system and they're about parring with each other. There's not much outside. I'll try and take you out and have a look. So this is what I've got over the top of my roof. Um, like you know, I've got the solar panel sitting on top. Uh, it's just pretty, pretty cloudy up there. And you've got the trees there, but there's not much shade coming off of those trees. So that's about it today, guys, from um, chucks and DIY chucks I have got some other stuff I've got to do uh, but hopefully you're all staying safe and staying positive and having a great day all right I'll catch you on the next one